Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try one of these Boomerang's Australian inspired American made chicken classic. Uh, this is like a hand sandwich, like a, it's kind of like a hot pocket, but it's a round one. Um, we bought these at Kroger 349, which um, isn't too off the bad. It's all natural white, white chicken and veggies in a puff pastry. Uh, it's an Australian twist on the standard pot pie. And like I said, these are kind of, uh, there's the ones I've had before, at least it worked in a container. It might have a container. I don't know. Uh, microwaveable box, so that's good. So I haven't opened it yet. I wanted to make sure I knew exactly how to do it. 310 calories for the whole thing, so I don't think that's bad at all. Uh, there's your information for you. It says 290 calories per boomerang, but it's actually 310. Go figure. Let's see, directions, directions, here they are. You can do this in the oven, but we're not going to. We're going to do it in the microwave. So we're going to leave uh, the boomerang in the microwave box, open one side uh, flat for just for ventilation. Place it in the microwave um, from frozen. We're going to heat it three and a half minutes, remove it from the box and let it cool for three, for five minutes before enjoying. So that's okay. That's what we're going to do. So three and a half minutes. It says it again on the edge right there. Okay, there's the, oh, it is an impact. So it is like a pot pie, okay. The, I've had some of those before that were like a hand sandwich, um, a hand sandwich, like a hot pocket that you didn't have to, um, it wasn't in a container. So this one's actually in a pot pie container. So I'm gonna get this in the microwave and I'll probably put a paper plate under it just in case it leaks out a little bit. But uh, anyway, I'll be right back. Hey, here it is out of the microwave. Not much to look at. It's an oval container, didn't expect that. So, uh, so anyway, this has to sit, it's supposed to sit for five minutes. So I'm going to let it sit. I'm assuming some of this will firm up a little bit as it sits, but I'm going to let it sit, maybe not five minutes, but I'm definitely going to let it sit for a little while and cool off. Uh, and then I'll be back to try it out. Had a little time to cool off. Here's what I'm going to take. It's from the center. There's some chicken, carrots, uh, looks like celery. Um, can't tell what it is and, and the actual crust. Like I said, I pull it from the center cause I didn't want to get that edge crust first. I want to get the center crust, um, just to try out first. Then I get the edge. The best part's the edge. So you, you know that's the last part I want to eat. It must have been peas. It must have been peas instead of um, and celery. Kind of looked like celery, but now I can see they're peas. Um, that has a good flavor to it. It's got, um, um, you can really taste the chicken. You really, the, the peas and carrots really stand out. The, uh, the crust tastes okay. I'm sure. Uh, the outside will taste better than the inside. Again, this is from the inside. That's good. I like the um, I like the the sauce. The, it's not really gravy, but it's like a sauce. I like it. Let me try a bite from the outside. Um, the crust is pretty crispy. You can kind of see how crispy the crust is on the outside. Hmm. I like that quite a bit. Now how they get, um, most pot pies you see are seven or 800 calories for a pot pie. This one, it's not quite as thick as those, but it is, um, it's still plenty of food and it's only 310 calories. It makes you wonder how they get there. But I do have to say it is really good. If you like chicken pot pie, um, you like that chicken and the carrots and the peas flavor, um, you'll really like this, I think. Uh, and if you want a lower calorie, which I'm surprised with. Um, if you want the lower calorie, you can't beat this. So I'm gonna actually give this one a five. Is it the best pot pie out there? No, but it is a super good pot pie for the amount of calories it is. So I'm gonna balance both of those. Um, Flavor-wise, it's really, really, really good. Um, and for the amount of calories it is, it makes it even better. So, so yeah, I'm gonna give it a five. Definitely try them out if you get them in your Kroger. Um, I think you'd really like it. Um, I really like it. So hope you enjoy this video and thanks for watching.